There's a boatload of objects in Lumion 12, something like 6,400, everything you could possibly need to landscape, populate, and decorate. And good news, in Lumion 12, objects are better organized and easier to navigate. Let me show you. Library objects in Lumion 12 are organized in collections, which makes them easy to browse and find objects you are looking for. For example, when you go to the object category People and Animals and select Men 3D or Women 3D, for each character, all of its different versions and animations are grouped in a collection. Click on Toggle Thumbnail Size to show them bigger. At the bottom, you will see a preview image plus a number of tags. All objects in Lumion have some of these tags. Clicking on a tag name brings up all objects with the same tag. Use the scroll wheel to quickly browse through pages of objects. Click on the toggle favorite star to add an object to your favorites collection. Some objects can be colored. If this is possible, a color ring will show up in the bottom left of the preview image, like this car. The outdoor and indoor objects are all available under the objects category. Oh, and of course, you can always search for a specific object. To import your own objects, click on Imported Models, and then click on Place. When you start up Lumion for the first time, this area will be empty. After you load an example scene, some items of the scene will be shown here. Click on Import New Model and select the file of the design you made in your CAD software. Click in the scene to place it. It's a good idea to place your main item at the origin, indicated by the three colored lines. Let's take a look at the imported model. Click on Select and scroll out. To circle around the house, press and hold the O key on your keyboard and the right-click button on your mouse, then move the mouse to orbit. The library is organized in folders. To see this in action, let's import a decoration object and place it inside the house. Navigate closer to your target, click Place again, and then click the Import New Model button. Let's store this object in a new folder called Decoration Items. This way, you can organize your own imported objects in collection folders. And more importantly, Easily find them later in the same way you find other objects in Lumion. Groups in Lumion are always organized in a similar way. Load up the example scene, Glass House. Move inside the house. Let's make a group of the table, chairs, and plant. Select the objects category and click on select. Press the control key and drag a box around the table and chairs to select them. To also add the plant to the group, click on the Nature category and control click on the plant. In the top right dialog box, click on the button Add Current Selection to Group, and then click on Save Group. Similar to the imported objects, we can now create a folder for this group, for example, Furniture Groups. If we now want to place this dining set into another project, for example, Villa Cabrera, it's available under Groups and we can easily place it in the scene. Groups created in older versions of Lumion can be added into the group's library by using the Import New Group button at the top of the group library window. It seems like everybody has their own preferences and strong opinions when it comes to workflow and organization. Lumion 12 sits right on the fence. It's flexible and makes it really easy to organize your library in a way that works for you. I'll see you next time.